Learners in the country have an extended holiday by another one month. The schools that were initially to reopen for second term on May 4th could now resume in June, but only if the country manages to combat the spread of the coronavirus pandemic. Education Cabinet Secretary Professor George Magoha announced the decision reached by the COVID-19 National Emergency Response Committee. In the interest of the safety and lives of our children, our beloved children, the government has decided to extend school closure for one month, effective from the date of opening. Despite speculations and anxiety among parents and candidates over the fate of the national examinations this year, Professor Magoa says the calendar for both KCPE and KCSE exams remains intact. Whenever the examination is going to be administered, every child, every Kenyan child, will have been given the opportunity to cover whatever time that is lost before the said examination is administered. At this point that I'm speaking to you, the government has not decided to postpone both the Kenya Certificate of Primary Education and the Kenya Certificate of Secondary Education. The major concern raised by education stakeholders is how the syllabus will be covered and whether all learners will be playing on level ground when normalcy returns. Though Professor Magoa has assured the nation of the government's many interventions during the period which the learners will be at home, there are those who feel some learners will be disadvantaged. Three. For instance, while the government has rolled out a digital learning program engineered by the Kenya Institute of Curriculum Development, the program is not accessible to a majority of children in the country. There are those from poor households and regions that cannot access internet or television. In some private schools, parents are already feeling the heat, with some schools asking parents to pay school fees for online learning. For now, though, the cabinet secretary has maintained that what matters most to government is getting back the learners to school alive and healthy. Makori Citizen TV, Nairobi. Now at the same time-